Welcome back to Motivation and Motion. The possibilities that can be in our life, the history that we can create, we can call it legacy, we can call it the story that we are writing or the story that's now untold can one day be something that is looked upon and is replicated again and again. Because we can choose to be great and we can be those people that set the example, that set the tone for everyone else to follow. But even that is not going to be enough for people to take action. Because I can see someone doing good and I can see them changing the world and I can admire them or I can detest them. Because I can say, oh, it must be good to be them because they have all of it worked out. But yet, they don't realize that that person had to go through it. They had to go through the failures. They had to go through the struggles. They had to live in those losses that they have had, that they have incurred, and that they will continue to have. People think that these people who emit success and glory and happiness and fulfillment, it was just given to them. But yet, that is so far from the truth. These people have earned this right for themselves. These people have decided that their life, their circumstance was not their destination. Yet many people, they treat their current circumstance as their final destination. They say this is the end of their era and the era that they had that was good. Their golden years are now gone. But today can be the beginning of a new mindset. It could be the beginning of a new era. It could be the beginning of a new story where you become the person that's going to change your future and your circumstance. You can call yourself a hero. You can call yourself a villain. It doesn't necessarily matter what type of mindset you give yourself as long as you give yourself some purpose. Because as long as you have a purpose and you understand why you do the things you do, you're going to be rising each and every day and making changes to the person that you truly want to become. And you can make those changes at every turn and at every era of your life. We go through these stages of development, whether we're a child, whether we're a teenager, or now we are a young adult. At no point in those stages should we be limited to our mindset. Should we be limited to what we can and can't do? We should be always looking for what we need to do at each point in our life. There's no set limits to what a person can do. There's no set limits to what a person can do. Those limits are always going to be given by us because society can tell you what you can and can't do. But at the end of the day, the end of what you can accomplish is dependent on you.